if Allah has accepted you, how do you know? That's the last question. You know how you know? Your life changes. That's how you know. Your life changes. When you go for Hajj, it's easy to fulfill the Hajj. But how do I know my Hajj was accepted? I will know it when if I come back and things have changed in my life positively. When you fast in Ramadan, your life changes, you're forgiven and all the sins are wiped out. How do I know that Ramadan was accepted when Ramadan exits and you know your life has changed? Something good has happened here. There's a good vibe. I'm now going to the mosque all the time. Something that's a sign Allah has forgiven you. It's a very good sign. When you seek forgiveness of Allah, how do you know Allah has forgiven you? When you quit a few of these things and your life changes somehow. Warm. Sometimes it happens because of the death of someone close to you. Your life changed. That death was a mercy for you. Subhanallah. Your life changed because you start thinking, gosh, my wife is gone. Guess what? I'm next. When you start thinking that your life changes, look forward to the day that you're going to meet with Allah and Allah Almighty will bless you in a billion ways. Look forward. It's going to be the best day, the best day because we're trying. We're packing away our salah. We're packing away good deeds. We're cleansing our hearts. We're removing hatred, malice, jealousy, envy, etc. against others from our hearts. You got a clean heart and you're trying to worship Allah and you're constantly seeking forgiveness. You don't need much more than that. You're a human. You're a mu'min. You believe in La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And you're trying very hard. Allah says, you did it. You have succeeded. That's what success is. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us all Jannah to fill those. We are human. We commit sin. We falter. Don't lose hope in the mercy of Allah. Keep trying. Never give up. No matter what. Come back and don't give up.